welcome back to my youtube channel guys this is the day one of arriving in northampton as a permanent resident <laughs> and the goal for today was to locate my workplace and of course do some shopping so let us go Never be Kingston. Mm. Go they wait like this. Mm. From here. Mm. 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 See the exit. I think we pick that. Let's go. There's, there's toilets. Colombiano. Oh tears when we are packing. <laughs> 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 mm. Mm. <laughs> 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 they show our one house for less of she buy 80 million. She the vest. She can't come UK. Eh? She can't no, come. No, no, no. She they they have all the show for Lego. He said the, the, the both of them. How can you come and show her a cube of sugar? <laughs> See. See the water is falling from there. <laughs> 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 Oh, you don't know. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, 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 okay. But let's write it. Don't know. They don't know what they're. They don't know what they are saying. Babe, we don't know anything. What do you know? Maybe it's the weather that messed it all up. Yeah. Uh, Oski. Hmm? A lot of people do their Oski over there. But well, to be honest, this is not safe. You put, you put like a guard over here. You understand? You fall in, uh -huh. and you won't be able to see the You don't know the depth. Exactly. You understand? And you are not. The water is not transparent. It's not uh, clear. You can't see anything inside. <laughs> With the view of River Northampton. Is this lovely, well constructed, modern? Yes, now it's possible. See what it's See, guys, safe. Yes, very possible, baby. Oh. 
Hello, cutie kitty. You are so cute. <laughs> <laughs> it seems like you're enjoying the attention <laughs> babe it seems that one was enjoying the attention yeah yeah oh Babe, let me see. 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 see. Get the other side. Come on, come on, come on. I see ya. Ah. Ah, okay. Let's go, let's go. You're blocking someone. No, 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 take your time. No, no, no. <laughs> I will buy you. I want. Ah, you don't let me come. It's like, this place is like warehouse. Mm -hmm. Like warehouse. Mm. Mm, okay. so. you want to do your video first. I have to be quick. Mm. I've called her several times, she's not picking. Then when she wishes we'll call, we'll tell her we have 20 15 minutes. Hey guys, one thing I, I love about I not tempting not... already is that compared to Kingston where I would hardly see this kind of stores nearby where I was living. Not something there is African stores all around easily accessible. I uh, and that is really really something that I love about Not Tempting because of course I love food. Food is life. Who doesn't love food? Social media gave me a lot of friends and one of them is a fellow one in me. A fellow one in me did not even stop at being a friend. She became a sister. She drove all the way to me from Milton Keynes to not tempting. She was our first visitor and once I saw her, I just started buying everything Bible. Like she even brought food. I'm going to show you the food she brought. I was not even expecting it. If you're only one in me, I love you. I love you, love you, love you, love you. Thank you so, so much, sis. She's on YouTube. She is a retired YouTuber. <laughs> and YouTube is a Feoluwa Yanura. You people should go and subscribe to that channel. I'm I've been dragging her. She must come back by fire by Tonda. In come with our bad look, what one rep and got a right? You got a right? Ticket Max, um, Agus, Iceland, Lindy, 
Fries Little Boy. <laughs> and this is a yummy jello fries that if you brought forward with spiced turkey. Oh my god, my husband enjoyed this food, eh? Hey, so that man and get, food. Um, five and six bonnets at the Nigerian store that we went to. Spend. So we decided to step out after having dinner to go and look for scotch bonnet because I wanted to cook the next day and I didn't want to go out the next day at all. It was for cooking and for resting. So we stepped out. First of all, went to Audi. Shubon, Akuri, Pepe. What do you think, guys? Let me know in the comment section. A lot of people are of their opinion, or let me say a lot of Nigerians in the UK, have the opinion that Aldi is the cheapest super mall in the United Kingdom. Hmm. Some people even call it poor man's shopping mall. Like Nigerians and classism, everywhere they go, they must know them. I know, I mean, uh, for me, Aldi is not really cheap. I just think it's just super affordable, which is great. The only thing I don't like is that I don't really like their veggies. They don't taste really nice, especially their banana. Oh my God, don't buy your bananas at Aldi. Another thing I don't like about this mall is the fact that everything is just everywhere. The arrangement is so weird. And when the mall is not well arranged, it just makes your shopping a dick. I, I don't oh, like I don't it. I really don't like shopping great, there. Great. Unfortunately, that is the closest we will be more to us. And, you know, I just have to make do with what we have, yes, I guess. When we were at Howdy and we were checking out, I saw a Nigerian man. I approached him and I asked that we've been looking for Scott Bennett. Now, where can we get it around? Yeah, so he described a, a street to me that was just a few minutes walk down Howdy. And that's where we found varieties of like afro-caribbean stores <laughs> and i was amazed i'm like why did we go all the way to the other african store should i've just come here because the option eh, is just it's just endless so we started shopping another round of shopping <laughs> so it's a good place to start then we have we still have crayfish so if we don't i'm a picture because it means that we don't necessarily have to go to where we went to today do you get Where's Jolly? <laughs> Those are their whole, no the that. Where is? Yeah. That's like the red door, no the red door like that, like that. Welcome to day two, guys. And day two was for unpacking and cooking for my husband. It was time to repay my husband for all of the hard work and packing and unpacking. You know, I just felt like this gentleman here deserves to be pampered and giving good food. The plan was to make goat meat soup. It will do beggary and the softest hamala hamala to fill ability for this man. It came with a lot of food from Nigeria. I mean, two big full Ghana must go of grocery. My grand, my mother-in-law rather sent all of that. And this man, look at him, hard working man. Wait a minute, love. So you watched okay. every bit of them. Mm -hmm. oh, Even that rack now in the kitchen. They but they're all dirty, very dirty. Oh well done. Fun is good for uh, good for the mood. my husband i hardly want to do anything like <laughs> even when we have ladder in the house i don't want to use the ladder i mean can you see his feet tall man don't want to mad ladder anyway i got him to kindly help me put some items right in the kitchen because this appears to be like her only store i mean storage space in this house so we're trying to make the best use of it
all right guys let the cooking for my husband begin the first thing i have on fire right now is my goat's meat i'm steaming it um you know seasoning it put a lot of things inside that's why i love to make my meat and even my chicken i put in a lot of spices sorry i didn't show you all that process because to be honest the reason why we have this vlog is my husband he's the one that's always saying ah this is capturable i mean this is capture this is youtube worthy content my darling let me record you so left to me anyway i was just checking my goat meat here stirring it turning it around to see ensure that every ingredient enters every piece of meat in that pot the next thing we're preparing now is the the soup itself so i'm adding tomatoes long pepper red pepper red bell pepper scotch bonnet red chili you know i and an onion be very big onion and i'm gonna blend all of that together and that will you know, make my goat's meat soup for what we have planned for dinner You're tired, something that you just started. Hey, that's tired. <laughs> when my mom wants to punish my brother, this is what she gives him to do. <laughs> it's funny for leaving me in the kitchen since. <laughs> <laughs> Blend it and save it. So okay, finally, so our begri is almost ready, and my husband was just asking me why is why it called, called begri if it's made from it's beans, made from beans or whatever. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't show you guys the process of making this. Next time, I'll show you this wasn't planned, you know. So I'll show you guys next time. So our goat meat soup is ready, our begri is red, almost ready, and our ewedu is all set to go. guys if you've been following our vlogs you notice that my husband after cooking he does not like to leave anything unclean like he likes to just clean up after cooking and me i'm already getting used to this yes show i'm getting used to this sir you might just have to put all this to your cv because me how i don't want to do anything again you know intentionally i'll be leaving things for you like this because i know that you enjoy it boy you know help me as my loving and sweet husband so be, be warned in advance long may it continue and yeah just before we served dinner i decided to raise my leg a bit and you know let my husband also rest guys it would do a bit eh? I will draw a bit. See the bigger. You see how it's in stick. It's not all this watery bigger. You see the way it is already getting cold. That's why. Now look at this soup. Now rate this soup. Right, rate this. Rate this soup by over 10. 10 or 10 or more. Ah, ah, I was just looking for all the rich rich. I'm packing it for my husband because he deserves it. So this night I made a furry roll, I made beguri, I made the widu, I also made goat meat soup and my husband was just appreciating me and trying to give me a massage even though he couldn't wait for us to go into the other room so that he can give me the other massage, internal massage, sorry guys. <laughs> After cooking, I decided to do a cleaning of the cooking space where my husband was waiting for me for us to go to bed together. And that brings us to the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching this video, guys. I really do appreciate your time. And if you really like this video, if you enjoyed it, please click the like button. It's going to tell the glory thing that you did and they will suggest it to other viewers like you to watch. And likewise, you can support me by clicking on the 
thanks button if you're yet to subscribe kindly subscribe i'll see you guys in my next video take care love you